Ay, ay, ay. What a stream it has been. Well, that was the mission. <clears throat> oh. Wait, I'm just starting, am I? I don't know. Thought it was already over, but apparently it's not over yet. According to the astronomical reports. <laughs> Anyways, welcome to the stream. What do we do? What are we doing? I'm debating getting rid of these ammos. You know, snipers don't really need it. The, uh, what's it called? His 35 range, right? Laser pistol. <sighs> I kind of want to use the laser pistol, man. How are our energy people? 128, 79. You're physical. You're big. You're big, and you're whatever. Oh, 128 could be, could be decent. So I bought the environmental suits. Farsight is the one with Mark II uh, metal. Everybody else has environmental one, and Glue has environmental two. Where's the pistol? You also have this thing, the Ruger. I don't even know what it uses. 556. Oh. What's the range on the Ruger? Oh! Ew! Gross! Right. <laughs> the range is gross. It's disgusting. Small energy poo. 35 range, 1328. But it's a laser damage. Wait a minute, normal fire, gas, ex explode, energy and electric. Oh, energy is the same. It's no matter what, there's no plasma and laser, there's just energy. That sucks. And electric was around in Fallout 2 as well, but it was a hidden stat. Damn, this sucks. Yeah, metal is better against energy than against normal. But I mean, we have this. I don't know how viable energy weapons will be in late game. We're going to be fighting robots. So, who knows. So 500 is 37 pounds. 500 is 8 pounds, yeah. These fucking things are heavy. I think I don't want to carry them around just for a pistol. Fuck it. We might never use the laser pistol. Laser pistol is always kind of let down, to be honest. It's by the time you get it, it's usually something that you don't want to waste your ammo with. You want to wait a couple hours to get something better that's longer range. Anyways, little Kansas is the or Kansas City is the next. So we don't need a uh, debriefing. We just need to fucking go. I mean, I can. I guess I can look at the people. They got a little more steam packs. Got some uh, super stims. Ammo's are decent all around. I think this guy has less. Five fifty six or seven sixty two because he's using shotguns as well. Everybody is okay. She's got the uh, the only non sniper stuff. And we got. Everybody got some uh, red axe and red away with them. Because we're gonna need it, so. Yeah. Let's get our buttholes on the road. Let's go to Kansas City! After this break from our sponsor.
Hell yeah, cake. Not for me though. Cake for someone else. Oh. For me, I got a video game. Alright. Can see yes. Giant rats. I still don't know why giant rats are appearing now. Aren't they like trash? I'm kind of intrigued. What the fuck is that? That's not a rat. That's not a rat, that's a y'all guy. That's not a fucking rat, what the hell? This is scary. You would mutilate me? Well... Guy's just standing there. Holy fuck. Those are not rats. Those are anything but. What the hell? That was messed up. Alright, who's who's ready to take this trash off these corpses? Spawn with some melee weapons, I see. Some drugs. That's not a giant rat. What the fuck? <laughs> Alright, now we know that giant rats are... Uh, what probably becomes the Yauga in Fallout 3. Jesus. Okay, so yeah, they do spawn without ammo. In random encounters. That's so trash. So even if you like l run out of your good ammo and load up your shitty 9mm with the submachine guns and you start going at people. Wasn't there like another guy we killed? What the hell? Beast Lord, Beast Lord, there's another Beast Lord. I saluted them. So yeah, even even if you load up with with nine mils to maybe farm some beast lords, they spawn without ammo, so you're shit out of luck. Maybe ghouls can be farmed because I know all the ghouls on the overworld are hostile. Who who's looting them? Is it Jax? This Jax. We got a hunting rifle and we got the fucking festering speed. Also, I took away the uh, cocaine from all these assholes, you know, the snipers. Stitch has a lot of cocaine. Stitch doesn't need the perception, so he's going to cocaine back himself. And of course Joe, because Joe is addicted to that stuff now. It's canon. Joe, Joe loves that shit. There you go. So everybody go back to 66%. And I guess... I guess now we know what these are. The only thing I haven't seen are the Komodo dragons. Don't know what's up with dudes. Will this stop us? Yep. God damn it. Ugh, fat ass fucking car. I also went back and got all the mines from uh, Saint Louis. Saint Louis. Saint Louis. I don't know. Uh, some mines were on the extraction zone, and we kind of, kind of ran into them while trying to extract. <laughs> but other than that, it was just you know me clicking on mines. I I realized that I ha I can just left At click. Ease, brother, scouts have followed one of the fleeing mutant groups to Kansas City. As we suspected, we have discovered another mutant base. But an assault on this compound will have to wait, for our scouts have made quite a discovery. 
One of our scouts stumbled upon the ghoul town of Gravestone. What little is known about the town suggests that it was a major nuclear launch site before the war. The peaceful ghoul population which resides there are suspected to be directly descended from the original silo staff. They are seeking our help due to super mutant attacks. These attacks mean the super mutants are after something the ghouls have. This leads us to believe that something might be an intact nuclear bomb. I shudder to think what the super mutants would do with such a destructive device. You will go to Gravestone and talk to the ghoul bishop. Assure him that we will defend him and his town in exchange for the very bomb coveted by the mutants. An attack is imminent, and it will take some time to get enough squads to fully safeguard the town. Your squad must hold off the mutants until Smear and Shadow squads arrive. Protect the ghouls of Gravestone and don't let the bishop die. His knowledge of the nuke will be all we have. I'm going to hate this. Send Repo squad to collect the nuke when the bishop consents. The quartermaster will supply you with some rad X and rad away. We advise you to monitor your radiation levels at regular intervals. Dismissed. I'm going to hate this mission. Oh, also, is it the ghoul bishop or is his name bishop? No. Oh. Immediately do a big save. Time for some molding. Let's look at the map. Hopefully time is not going while we look at the map. So we just spawn in the middle. Ooh, acolytes with LOU entry. Yeah. North entrance to the church. Town schools are defending it. West entrance to the church. Town schools are defending it. They are not going to stand a chance against the super mutants. Ghoul cathedral. The bishop resides here. Ghoul citizens have gathered in the cathedral for protection. Okay. So we just need to somehow get on the roof right with all the snipers so three guys on the roof popping and three of them just at the doors with burst weapons so if someone runs in we can just brrrr, you know cut them down south entrance to the church ghouls are defending it eliminate super mutant threat eliminate super mutant threat eliminate super mutant threat so we have super mutant threat from only the uh, south entrance but i have a feeling they're going to ambush they're gonna maybe, maybe there's someone in here and it's gonna be like all right our our homies are attacking and we're gonna just me you know because the the metal pipe wielding super mutants are kind of sneaky they are like nightkin i i don't know when the attack starts if we get a timer or not or it just happens. Can I talk to the bishop peacefully, calmly, while while we're doing what we're doing? Who knows? Hey, Brian, talk to Boo. Any sign of them? I don't know, man. You tell me. Hope you fuckers are not glowing. Oh, that's a nuke. That's a nuclear reactors. Hey, let me in, pussy. Oh, they let me in. Okay. Acolyte, Bishop de facto. Stay away from that nuke. You with the advanced radiation thing. Go and talk to Defcon. Greetings. I am Defcon the second, son of T minus. Welcome to the holy land of Gravestone. Your elders want Platonus. Oh, they are coming already. Idol of the supreme nuclear power. The mutants want Platonius too, but they have no respect for our launch. As Bishop of Lunch. Gravestone, I am the sworn caretaker of the sacred idol of Platonius. You wish to remove our idol to within the confines of the Brotherhood, yes? <laughs> well, if you are mighty enough to stop the pagan mutant threat to my flock, you may take our divine patron of atomic vision. Can I have a Halenudran? Blessed are those who understand the divine release of charged atomic particles. For those who do not shall be plagued with incapacitation and forceful vomiting. Welcome to the radiant silos of Plutonius. Defend his irradiated flock of devoted gamma caretakers and be rewarded with an idol containing his heavenly fire. Take these. 
but his power is harmful to mere humans. Hey, I got some shit. They are cool, man. They winded each other. They'll go away. Anyone who can't run, stays. North gate. Is this north gate? Oh fuck, what happened there? Okay, we can't go up on that fucking thing apparently. Yeah, she can't climb up there. What the fuck is the point of this then? Oh shit, this part got wiped out. Can't you shoot? First them. Run away, man. No, run away. Why can't you see that guy? Dude, he's not dead, he's lobbing shit. Bitch. Gained a lot of XP. I don't know why they don't reload when they have the chance. We gotta run back. shooting what is this guy doing someone's blowing us up who the fuck Wait, who's there motherfucker Bitch, get back down. Because apparently we can't go on these things. Is 
This side has fallen. Run, pussies, run. Okay, it's totally fucked. It's concussed. No, so you stay there. Stay there. No, 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 stupid faggot. I mean, <clears throat> I'm sorry. I'm stressed. <laughs> Already threw out an F-bomb. And no, not fuck. The other one. The bad one. The no-no one. Why are you not shooting? Joe, you stupid. Stim yourself. Keep stimming. Alright. Doc. You need, you need to heal yourself. I think they might come in here. I'd have to pull back. How about this side? It says it's doing fine. Got mutants. But otherwise they're doing fine. You need to send someone out here to just check the place. And who would be better than... Uh, Brian, of course. Because he's a runner. They have assholes on the top here. Uh, hey, Brian. Where you at? Buddy boy. You got level 12 though, but I don't think I want to... Uh... Is time stopped when it we're going? Looks like time stops when we're in the menu though. Maybe I could. Oh, that's where we go up. So, on this we can go up. On that, I, I, I don't think I can because I can't see the ladder. If there's, oh, fuck. Fuck, 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 mines. Fucking mines, man. Brian. Not paying attention, Brian. Stupid idiot. Do a save. I shouldn't really loot, though. Dax is missing a super mutant. So they probably came from here. No one left these. Alright. Superman Newton has his left arm broken. Are you guys shooting them? Have to be. Oh yeah, there's another uh, ladder there, but I mean, who cares? Okay, so Brian got that side covered. Defend with Cathedral. They're turning to Teo. We stopped them. Oh, we, we did it. I wanted to run in here to check what the hell is over here. Defend the Cathedral is down. So what do we do now? Protect the Ghoul Bishop. Defend the cathedral, seek out and destroy super mutant commanders encompassing the cathedral. Alright, so now we need to push out and kill the, uh, the Goyams. I don't know. Is that a swear word? I have no idea. So did our uh, brothers arrive?
Where did they arrive from? Because it said defend until the brothers arrive, you know, smear and smudge the squads or whatever. But I don't see any humans other than us. So I do not know what to trust. Um there's a crate here we can put stuff into. Actually, what's in the crate? Get your ass up. Mines. They can stay there. This crate is going to be our loot crate. The defending ghouls are kinda dead. What do you mean you can't reach? Go around the fucking thing, you stupid. Alright. They had some ammo for us. But does this mean that they are not going to attack anymore? Hope it does. What is that? Oh, okay. Someone just ran in here with a nif and fall. Then 62 as well, assault weapon. Is this an upgrade to the uh, AK? It probably is, right? Shit range. Absolute garbage range in uh, burst. Decent range in uh, single fire. 24, 36. 24, 36. Okay, so worse range than the sniper, but a lot better minimum damage. We're going to keep those. And probably never use them because we have the burst. This burst boy, it's 40 range. It also uses the 762. 2030. And this was 35 range in bur in single. But yeah, why the fuck would you use the F and Fell? We have the saws. And sure, snipers do less damage. In single and they are also single fire, but they have 50 range over 35. So next 15 extra range. So we can just snipe stuff, and once it gets too close, we and we swap to this. This also has 40 range, so you know. <laughs> I think the saw is one of those weapons that are arriving a little too late. A little too late. Okay. The weapon is already full. This grenade guy was pissing me off. It was just prone here, throwing grenades at the fucking what's his face. Okay, this motherfucker doesn't know what a sandbag is. Sandbag wall. Okay, so the ghouls had some FN files. Which is not bad. I mean, it is strong, so once something gets into in range, it's definitely better than... Uh, whoops, I'm stupid. It's definitely better than uh, the AK. But it's not better than the saw when something gets in range. Actually, it might be, because it's stronger, but 18 range versus 40, if you want to burst. And 35 range versus 50. I guess if you want to have uh, lighter weaponry on you, it could make sense. But who the fuck wants lighter weaponry? There was this missile guy. Oh, the fucking crate is full kidding me? What are we gonna do? Where do we put our shit? I don't want to put it on corpses. Oh no. I already hate this mission. No car means bad loot. Bad loot means... Oh wait, there's a crate. Bad loot means uh, not a lot of good stuff. Okay, so this is a... Oh, look at that. Medic supplies. It's nice. His ass runs out to get these corpses. Hopefully he won't get shot. Fucking metal pipes. I might drop the metal pipes on the floor. 
I don't know how long it takes for things on the floor to despawn. But I think bodies despawn faster. And if there's something on the bodies, it despawns with them. Fucking hell. That's it for this crate. No, don't fuck with me. Okay. Take at least one. There you go. God damn it. Oh my fucking god. Can you- Oh, whoa, what the fuck? Sabot! Can you take at least one of these heavy-ass rockets? No. Oh, my god. I might have to use these, give them to Jax and- Or, actually, Brian. Although, we knew what happened with the rocket launcher. Immediate satisfaction of comedic value. He aimed and he blew up. <laughs> yeah. Alright, get off the roof, asshole. I don't eat garbage like that. Yeah. So are these the inspiration for, or were these guys the inspiration for the Children of Atom in uh, the Fallout games? Most notably Fallout 4, where they created an entire evil cult based on the uh, Atom people. Alright, you have the highest radiation resistance, I think. Yeah, A5 only, for some reason. I thought it was 95. Oh yeah, this bitch doesn't have any. Uh, 60. These are all 60, because they have the same suit. So you should be the one to go in there and search for any container we can put that shit in. Could you move out of the way? Is this... Is this guy for real? Might be a suicide bomber or something. A suicide ghoul. This guy had the sniper rifle. He's nice, I guess. Actually, I am going to take out the metal pipes and just... And again! These also basically have the same worth, right? We want a diverse stock, not just the same weapon sold over and over, because their value diminishes the more you sell to the Quartermaster. So it doesn't really matter what I save. Drugs are basically the only one you want to keep, but drugs don't have weight. Right, we, we saved your people. And Plutonius said to Adam, he who collides with another particle will in turn split the air asunder with shimmering power until his enemies are vanquished! By purging our lands of the decadent, you will prove yourself worthy of taking the sacred mortal form of our god Petonius and deliver the flesh of my mighty lord to your bunker of the Holy Brotherhood. And they are not holy, though. This is how he decrees his will be done. Cool, man. Cool. Can I have more drugs? These places are fucking empty. There's nothing here. Get pulled, pussy. Alright. Okay, assholes. I'm gonna start with the top corner.
throw anything we don't care about on the floor in this in this little spot. So extra sniper rifle, don't care. Ammo you keep. You're done. You two didn't loot. You go forward. And then I also uh, spend levels as well. Extra whatever, you don't care. Give the shotgun shells to the man. The stitch. You're good. What do you have? The fucking metal pipe. And another gun. You're good. Huh! Rockets. Cyber rockets wouldn't be bad to sell, but they are super heavy. Look at that shit. Seven for 35 pounds. Get out of here. Okay. And what we loot is going to be... And this watches over us. Oh, these guys didn't die. How sad. What we loot is going to be mostly ammo and other lighter supplies, like mines, for example. There's a dead ghoul. A dead mutant. Any pipe mutants, I'm just not going to care. Yeah, fuck the pipes. Oh, look, this guy had a stun gun. Yeah, that's fine. Actually... It's close by here, so let's put it in the corner. I don't know what respawns faster. Well, there's the ammo, I guess. Too bad there's no item highlight button or anything like that. Okay, Joe. You, you're up. Also, after I bought all the uh, environmental suits, because I had enough stuff loaded up in the cars that I could just barter for it, I even gained a little, I think I, like 200 extra bucks. So, you know, money's okay, I guess, for now. Alright, Joe. Your perception is back to normal, right? Yes. Traps are 80. Let's give you a level up first. Action! Oh, we get the action boy stuff. At level twelve. It probably needs like six agility, but most of the people will be able to get it, or it might be just level tied. Agility or extra action point is not that important in constant uh, or continuous turn based, right? Because it's sure the initial burst you do. Once, uh, as long while you're burning up your uh, stockpile stuff, you know it could be an extra shot. Maybe, I mean she's got. Where's the action points? Eight points. She can, she can fire twice, actually three times because fast shot. Three with this, twice with this. But that extra one, I mean, it decreases the uh, the first waiting time. Or maybe even affords you an extra shot. But it's just the first, like, five seconds of the combat, and then you're back to just waiting, because it doesn't give you faster recovery. So I don't think I want to invest into that that heavily. Running, blah blah blah, bluff master, bonehead, bonus hand-to-hand, -hand, bonus move, bracing, demolition expert. Is what I might... Yeah, they always go... Oh no, this is the... This is not the one. This is when we blow them up. No, I want to... Uh... Mad Bomber or something? That might be a perk, though, or a trait, though, I don't know. Dodger is not that bad. Explorer, Faster Healing Child. There's the Gain stuff, which I might have to put one Perception and one Luck. Apparently we can gain Luck as well, so that's very good. Yeah, we can gain everything. Here and now, hit the deck. Life Giver, Life Step. Oh, when you move on them. That's stupid. Medic. Oh, that's the uh, bonus first aid and doctor skills. Yeah. Healing skills are a good thing. Sure. Mr. Fixit. Pack Rat. Pyromaniac. Quick recovery and quick pockets. Red Rizzy. Snake Eater. Stonewall. Strongback. Stuntman. Swift. Learner. Tank! We can tag a new skill to increase it twice as fast. I could tag big guns for her. Thief and tunnel rat. 
I think I need... What do I need uh, for Mad Bomber? I'm going to look up the fucking perks. Uh, because I, I definitely need specials. I need at least one more perception, I think. So, let's look at the perks. Oh, I lost the... What? My browser lost the ability to do the uh, text-only pages, so it doesn't load up any pictures and stuff. What the fuck? What? I did it lose the ability, man. It downgraded itself, <laughs> somehow. Oh well, now we get all the fucking ads and pictures and shit. Extra network strain. I'm very happy about that. Alright, so level requirement skills. That's sorted by that. Brown Noser, Die Hard Awareness, Bonus Hand to Hand, Comprehension, Drunken Master, Fessory, Infirmary, Gunner, Healer, Here and Now. Healer is what we want on Stitch. It needs 7 Perception, oh, 6 Agility, 5 Intelligence. What the fuck? 7 Perception, yeah. So Hurt has 5 Perception, so even Hurt would need an extra 2 Perception. To get that shit. Yeah, so he's not going to have healer, which sucks because that would be his main fucking thing. And it has two ranks, so you could get 8 to 20 more HP with first aid and doctor. Which already, like, first aid kids barely heal half our HP at this point, so healer would have been very nice, but he needs 7 perception. Or, yeah, that sucks. Let food healer now. Night Vision, Quick Buckets, Red Child, Scout, Stat. Yeah, we don't care about Stat. Stonewall, Strongback, Survivalist. What is that? Outdoorsman, you know. Did I pause the game? Oh, it's paused and it's doing this. I hope I didn't uh, tab out. I didn't. I can still use the <laughs> big slots. Swift Learner, Team Player. So, Team Player needs 4 Charisma. Ah, okay. Perk is potentially bugged. Okay, great. I, I only gave it to like four members out of six. That's nice. Didn't know about it being bugged. Let's read up on this. Perk is bugged and only seems to work within the influence of other squad members with the team player perk. Wow, that sucks. But I mean, it also doesn't really suck because, as I said, I think I have like four people with team players, so... I just have to make sure that team players are within team players influence. Stupid. Oh well. Thief toughness, 6 endurance and 6 luck, yep. Yeah. But it only gives you uh, normal DR. Right? Follow up tactics. Yeah, normal damage resistant, not laser, fire, plasma, electric. Yes. Not the worst, but yeah. Where are we? Toughness, bracing, death sense. That's for death claws. Flexible, hit the deck. Leader loner. Leader. Charisma 6. Plus 1 agility and plus 10 AC to all squad members. Tooltip is incorrect. Oh yeah, because Tooltip says 5. I read about Leader. 6 Charisma, no one has that and no one will. Loner, Steady Arm. What's Steady Arm? Minus 1 AP for Burst Shot. Oh, it's Super Mutant only. Oh, Super Mutants could burst. With 3 AP? Oh, that's pretty fucking gnarly. We don't have Super Mutants in our Recruit Pool yet. I, th I was hoping for Super Mutants once we, uh, you know, don't destroy the uh, Scientist's garbage. But apparently that didn't prompt any super mutant recruits. Maybe they need to grow up yet. Or first. Drowning rush, bonus move, bonus range to damage. Six agility, six luck. I want that. Because it's not bad. It's 15%. And you have two tiers on it. It excludes throwing attacks. But other ranged attacks work. No matter what type. Six agility, six luck. Are you fucking kidding me? So she would gain. She would need to gain a lock. Because with fucking big guns, right? That would be extremely good. So let's open up bonus range. Then we're gonna 
second tab to know that that's one I'm looking at. Yeah, ghoul one, educated gambler, ghost, death, uh, harmless, stealing, hefo, more criticals, six luck for more criticals. 5%, then you can take it three times. Negotiator, Packrat, Pathfinder, Quick Recover, Red Resi, Ranger, Salesman, Silent Running, Snake Eater, Stuntman, Way of the Fruit. Oh, it says temporary strain after eating a fruit, but I read it gives permanent. Might be. Oh, it's Charisma 6, so nobody's gonna have it anyways. I guess we can sell the fruits. Temporary plus one to your strain. But in theory, this perk should be effective with bonsai. However, bonsai seems to never provide any fruit. Well, that's another fucking uh, perk slash trait bugged for you. I love these old games; they just don't work, uh, or you know, they just work. Uh, Stott Howard would say. No wonder he took over the uh, Fallout franchise. <laughs> uh, Bonehead Bluffmaster, brutish hawk, psychotic. They're not human. Tunnel Rat, better criticals. Perception 6, luck 6, and agility 4. This is something I definitely want on people. Uh, 6 perception and luck. What the fuck? Again with the luck. Luck, luck, luck. There's Crazy Bomber. Failures with explosives are nullified. Because sometimes my uh, patience is really low with this shit. and don't, don't want to just reload. 6 intelligence and 60 traps. 6 intelligence. Motherfucker has 9. Wait, that's... That's Stitch, whoops. So she would need one intelligence now, and then she would she could get Mad Bomber. Or Crazy Bomber, okay. And then I can just spam click on the mines and bombs and uh, I wouldn't need to care. Because even if it's 1%, I don't have to reload. It just either doesn't go off or gets uh, uh, disarmed, so it never blows up at disarm uh, attempts, which is very good. Demolition Expert. Oh yeah, that's the other thing, when we blow up. Dodger is pretty decent, 6 agility, I think everybody has that. Maybe one person doesn't have that. Plus 5% armor class? Wait, that's false. It says plus 5 armor class. Unless armor class caps out at 100, in which case, yeah, it's 5%. I don't know that though. Where are we? Dodger, Explorer, Lightstep, Mutate is good. We are giving it to a lot of people. Pyromaniac, Sharpshooter. Perception 7, Intelligence 6. Sharpshooter might be good for like, uh, you know, burst weapons because they don't have as good accuracy as rifles, even at, uh, at their maximum range. So, uh, Eye of Scars is Deathclaw, Action Boy, 5 Agility is what it needs and level 12 so we just hit level 12 the action boy bonsai which is apparently bugged and needs a ghoul anyways gain is when you gain stats hand to hand evade life giver Ooh, life giver might be a thing plus four hp per level but it's it's basically the same as in fallout 2 two two tiers of it endurance four is needed everybody has that Low endurance people might need to take that, because they can't take toughness, although others can't take toughness either because there's no luck. Living anatomy, plus 10% doctor and fi plus 5 damage to live creatures, doctoring 60%. Okay, Stitch might get this, at least he can get something decent. Plus 5 damage to living creatures, although endgame it's not going to do anything because robots, but... Right now, against Super Mutants, it's nice. Plus 5 guaranteed damage. So I wonder, that even if it, he misses, it's 5? <laughs> or can he can he still miss? I guess he can still miss. Master Thief, Master Trader, Medic. Plus 20% to First Aid and Doctoring. We don't care. Mr. Fixit, Road Warrior. No penalties for shooting by driving. Tag. We can pick a tag. Helen of Fear is Deathclaw, Toughhide is Super Mutant. Weapon Handling, plus 3 Strength for Weapons uh, Strength Checks. That's pointless, because we can hold on until we get uh, Power Armor. And then, you know, give Power Armor to the Heavy Weapon people first. 
Uh, Divine Favor is level 24. Or 14, not 24. Plus one to highest primary statistic. Minus one per crate. Oh, wow. Charisma 8. Yeah, <laughs> that's not going to happen. Uh, and we have bonus end to end attacks. Bonus rate of fire at 15. Why 15? What? Oh wait, that's actually good. 12 is the uh, the uh, perk stuff for humans and then 15. Okay, that's that's good. My bad. For some reason I was I was like 16 is when you get a perk, but no, I'm stupid. Yeah, um 6 perception, 6 intelligence and 7 agility. Everybody needs bonus rate of fire. I want I want that on everyone. So, 6 perception Six intelligence and seven agility is what we want. There's also pickpocket, ignore size and facing modifiers while stealing. What a fucking load of bullshit. Siren death. Hit a critter in the back while sneaking for a double damage hand to hand attack. What the fuck? What is this, Skyrim? Slayer for hand to hand and sniper. Which uh, works, but not really. But then, yes. But only with select weapons. <laughs> Level 24. And some were cut from the game. There's a cut perk, Twitch Gamer. I think that that's not the Twitch we are streaming on. It's it's the Twitch when you get twitchy, you know, you tweaking, tweaking out. All right, so sharpshooter might be good. I think the most important is bonus uh, ranged damage and also what what the sniper needs. Sniper needs eight perception, eight agility. So we can prepare for that with the the two snipers. Sharpshooter, life giver is not bad. It's level twelve. Wait, it's level twelve and you need endurance four. She's got endurance four. Ah, oh, there's light life giver. The game is pooping itself, yeah. But I think I'm going to go for stats. We're going to gain. Although life giver, goddamn, it's best to take it early on. I became a fucking unkillable meat mountain in Fallout 2 by the end because of life giver. Shit. Living anatomy is only for Stitch, and he needs doctoring 60. But I might not give him re living anatomy anyways, because uh, bonus range to damage is the most... No, actually, not bonus range damage. Bonus rate of fire. Where's bonus rate of fire? There it is. So we need 6B, 6I, and 7A. So 6B, 6 intelligence, and 7 agility, so we definitely need to gain shit. Wow, six, six, seven. So she needs to have three gains. And bonus rate of fire comes at level 15, so next perk. Fuck. She might not get it. Who wants it? Your perception is seven. Normally, so you would be okay with that. Your int is okay and your agility is okay. So she can have bonus, uh, whatever the fuck, rate of fire. Sniper, on the other hand, needs eight perception. And eight agility. So she needs to gain a perception. She has perception, but she needs to gain an agility. Or sniper. Yeah. She also needs to gain. Actually, what is it? Seven, six, and seven for bonus rate of fire? Oh, six, six, seven. Yeah, six, six, seven. So she's got enough for bonus rate of fire at level 15. What about you? 6, 6, 7. Okay, so you need a perception and intelligence. You will not have it. 6, 6, 7. So you need 2, 3 perks. He needs 3 as well. Maybe that's why people take uh, better recruits. Because their specials are a little bit better distributed. Six, six, seven. Okay, he can also have it. Damn, Jax is decent. Uh, so, yeah. This is going to be a min-max city right now. 
So what do you get? You get better crits, but you don't need that. Six, six, seven. So you have that. You need one perception. Or, uh... What's his face? Sniper. So you're going to gain a perception. Unless she ate two. I don't remember how many fucking fruits she ate. You know what? You can do this after the mission. We don't need it now. We don't care. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. Actually, the one I give a fuck about is... Uh, what's the uh, crazy bomber again? We need six intelligence. And we already need six intelligence for bonus rate of fire, so... I guess this asshole can get one intelligence. What a waste. But it's been done. Ugh. Oh, really? Just didn't get that extra percentage. That sucks. Put it up to 100. What else do I want to put on her? We don't need more traps. 80%. And then we get Crazy Bomber at level 15, and then we don't need any traps anymore. But yeah, I guess she's just going big guns. Maybe I should have tagged her fucking big guns. Whatever, fuck it. I don't care anymore. So what I re learned is that I don't need to press 4 and then click on the mine. I can just click on the mine. And then they will go and try and touch touch. She's gonna blow up. Oh! She didn't blow. Also, Farsight needs to come out here because she's got the eyes. Pipe man. Jesus Christ. A lot of muties with just pipes. Uh, but it's actually not bad because... or That's kind of smart because... Uh, you know, they, they rush at us with the pipes and while... We automatically start shooting at the pipe people. The uh, others getting get in range and start bursting. Are these the same? Oh, these are these kind of mines. Kill personnel. Ha. <laughs> Oh, does. We have the power of God and any man on our side. Okay, so I'll sold more of the larger mine to the quartermaster, so we can keep these mines on us and whatever. All right, people. Oh, very, very nice. <laughs> Who can sneak? Okay, whoever that is, far side. It's going to be the one to go in. Yeah, there might be nothing here. Something in this, definitely. Fuck sneaking. But is everybody on uh, ranged? Okay. I don't know where the uh, replacement brother squads are. We're just gonna run at this fucking building. Screw it. Is that a mine? We. It's a plane. It's burrowing. No one in here but some bookshelves. Is nice. Send one person in. Person with the highest armor rating. Also, Joe needs to come in here. Stuff might be booby trapped. I said, check it. 
kidding me? What are you doing? Oh, what is that? A Tommy gun? Why? I don't... I don't suppose it's better than what we have. Uses 45. We got a bunch of that for it. Fomzom. It can single fire. 32 range. Shit damage. I mean, shit minimum, but pretty decent maximum. Too large, though. Too large distance between the two. Or 25 range with even worse damage. Again, something that came a little too late. And we only have 150 ammo for it, so why the hell would I care? I guess we can give it to Jax, because he's a warrior and he yearns for blood. And what best best way to get blood than to, you know, gangsta the shit out of someone? Or actually, Mafia. I mean, they are the same, just one wears suits, the other wears bandanas and tattoos, I guess. And holds their guns, weirdly. Yeah, they are definitely going to wait for us. But we like that. Makes us feel special when people wait for us. What was that? Oh, that's an axe. Hello, Mister. Some bitch. We're taking back Ghoul Town. Let's go. Wait. Taking back Ghoul Town. Let's go. So the map is long this way, so we are here now. There's a yeah, we just started getting into position. Alright, you two. Okay, there's a dude. There be a dude. Go a little back. That's a too much. I said, what are you doing? What are you doing? Shoot him. Why can't you shoot him? Well, Stitch. You know what to do, right? Stitch. Yeah, Stitch knows what to do. There's a shelf he can touch. Stitch is going to run in here and get himself killed by this guy. Oh. Beach! Right. 
They sleep in normal beds, just like us. Shelf is metal. Ooh. That's nice. We used up one and a bunch of normal stim packs. Hey, what's up? this guy have cool grenades don't sell for shit at this point sold hundreds of grenades to the uh, to the guy ah. just trying to make him shoot his shit out ah. fuck you kill him What the hell is wrong with you? There you go. I had some ammo. I don't know why they insist on having crowbars though. Of science. What's your science? Uh, 102. Oh yeah, he didn't really get any science from that, right? Last time. 102. Or was it the outdoorsman person? What's your science now? Pussy 111. Okay, that still went up. That's decent stuff. we get in here metal shells there's a stuff we can touch which means there's stuff we can put stuff in no 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 I I love almost clicking on this but barely missing and then they just start running off and I get so angry <laughs> I get so mad Alright, Brian, no, Jax can check this out. Okay, that's good. Man, I'll have to run through this entire fucking place once again, just to loot everything and... And bring them back. It's gonna be so annoying. Or at the very end of the mission, I'm gonna do what I did with uh, with one of the other missions, where uh, there was one guy just standing at the edge, and I just ferry everything to them. No, oh, there's a guy. He likes us. So we checked this thing. This asshole. Why? Where are you going? What are you doing? Are you being stupid or are you just needed to pee or something? Guy has a saw, at least. A saw. Maybe something more. Oh look, we're next to the other... Uh, what's we call it? Also, I came here at night for some fucking reason. I didn't check the timer. I just realized that it's night time. Shit. Although that might be good for us though. Because, you know, we have night problems, they have night problems, hopefully. Easier to sneak around at night. So there's another guy watching. Um. Oh. 
Did he see us or? Then he just fucking hid. Stitch with a sniper rifle. It is one a one perception too, actually. <laughs> Alright, motherfucker hid. Now what? Do we just kinda start crawling up? Look like fucking bugs. Crawling. I can still tell uh, which of my character, which is my main character, because they have a brighter orange <laughs> uh, tint. Although now uh, Farsight is the one with no skin on their head. Now she's the skull person. Oops, I didn't want to do that. Accidentally pressed Q. Okay, somebody show him. I like how this guy shot his own friend in the back. Blue miss super mutant. Shot is blocked. Really hit super mutant. Or maybe it was our people. Our people. All right, boy, come back to the window and let this. Let's get this over with, man. Come on, man. <laughs> He definitely hit his guy on the in the back. Don't have an angle on this asshole. Oh shit. That guy's dead though. These metal shells are not touchable. What a stinker! There's a guy. You just somehow see him, but not see him, but see him. Oh, they had ghouls in here. Ducka, 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 ducka. Right. Have to check these dudes for their. Lunch money. Tasty, tasty ammunition. That's all we need. Yes. Bad idea, mister. Oh my god, are you kidding me? You concussed him in the ass. Ooh. 
I got concussed in the ass by Joe. That's not the time. It's certainly not the place. These ghouls are rotting. Ay ay ay. What the fuck? He got concussed in the air, sorry, let's save because if he if he fails, I'm gonna just reload. Healed. Yeah, but did you get unconcussed already? God unconcussed. What the hell man? Shoved the gun up his ass and concussed him. Which means the bullets came out on the other end. Was such a bad idea on my part. He kind of fucked up Jax. Where is Stitch going, by the way? What, what is he trying to accomplish right now? Oh, he tried to heal the guy because I kept the healing stuff on him. What the fuck? All right, he's got a lot of these things. So find the Jax in here and uh, the fuck. Alright, healed 4D, nice. Good man. Time to split up. Someone doesn't like us. Fine, get the fuck away from there. I need more Medicaid. God damn it. They're shooting us like shit. Oh, we can't come out here? That's a fucking opening. What the hell, video game? Fully healed, baby. Alright. So you're back to crawling all the time again. <sighs> Taking the ammo on the go because maybe they will start despawning by the time I'm done with the mission. I don't want them to despawn with the ammo. Rest can go, I guess. It's not that important. We have a lot of money saved up. the ammunition I would like to hold on to. Is this guy going to get up or is he dead? He's dead now. That's the edge of the map, right? Eh, kind of. But there was nothing here. Got a fields. Uh, looks like nothing in the field area. And everybody going to uh, crouchy, crouchy, crouchy. You can just tell they want to burst each other down again. There's a guy in here. He's 
state should just get one perception right now. What could I give him? Bluff master, hand to hand move, brown noser, dodger, educated explorer, flexible child, gains, gunner here, hit the life giver. Life giver wouldn't be bad. Oh, living anatomy, yeah. You know what? In theme, it's in theme with his, uh, what's it called? You know, being the medic and all. I know it's a waste. <laughs> but I don't give a fuck. Right, maggots. Position up, and then we just start shooting at this guy. I guess Farsight is going to get the, uh, the nastiest amount of damage from that. Yeah. Ready, went down. Everybody move up. This building is also a question mark. Shoot! He's dead. That was a different guy, though, I think. Yeah. Grenade! Perfectly fine. Explodes. Already get a 40% negative. Because we have good armor. Alright, just keep. Motherfucker. They got a bunch of lockers and such. Um, Joe is going to look around and check for any nasty surprises, though. Alright. Oh, a laser pistol. Thankfully, they're still using frag grenades and not plasma. That would hurt us. Although... Explode... Yeah, energy, we have better energy percentage, but less flat. So would plasma hurt us more? I mean, it deals more damage than frags, but we have more reduction to it. Interesting. Got a guy. They got a nice chest. Shelf. Shelves. Ooh, that's actually pretty good. Oh, fuck. We have a... This looks an, like an important building. Where are we? Oh. We should run back. Check these corpses. Stuff their stuff in these lockers. Yeah, this I didn't even have ghouls. Actually, there's one ghoul. 
Yeah, sure, take the pipes as well. Pipe goals. <laughs> I mean, I did hear a minigun, so it's not a surprise. I heard someone with a minigun. I think there was another minigun guy. Maybe this guy. Someone down here also. I feel like they were, he, they were minigunning. But oh boy, we got our first minigun. Another sniper from Ghoul Man. Thank you, Ghoul Man. Oh, wait, is this. Oh, it's a browning. That was that guy doing with a browning. Oh shit, he's like full already. Forgot to put his stuff in the lockers. Got the uh, 550. Wait, is it gonna use 556? Don't fucking tell me. What? I mean, I guess 5 mil, basically. But, I mean. I know what to do with these ammos then. I'm not using the M16 anymore. Brian is going to get his minigun and he will love it. Avenger replacement is the normal personal minigun. Avenger design improves. Jeffrey Kulik, blah blah blah. Alright. You are okay. Joe's got minigun. We can give it to Brian. Hey, Brian. Look at what we got for you. I mean, Joe could keep it as well. Joe's got big gun aspirations as well. The thing Joe doesn't have is enough strength. I think. What's the strength for this guy needed? Seven. Actually, ooh. Ha! Brian doesn't have the strength. Hey, Joe. Can give the... Get it back to Joe. Or, actually, Jax is going to be the minigunner. He's already got the uh, strength for it. Someone else has a minigun on them. Not you. It's gonna go for the locker. Dang it. That locker is full. It's got a lot of doctor stuff. And ammo, of course. Okay, so Jax has the minigun. Yoosh. Yoosh. So, 40 range. Nope, that's the wrong gun. 35 range. Yikes. 8 to 12. Man, I don't know if it's gonna be good, actually. You would have to run in with Stitch again. It's just fine. Look at him. The game even... Freezes when he starts to move. He's so powerful when he moves. Put this garbage away. Don't have weight. Alright. Go to Stitch. Give him the shotgun shells. 
And then I guess the uh, sniper's going to relinquish their uh, ammunition. He's going to chew through this fucking 556 in no time, though. I wonder if I should actually use this now. Or maybe I should wait with it. To, you know, maybe larger targets. Robots, maybe. Although, 812. It's gonna be a lot of garbage damage. Like, a lot of garbage damage. Unless it doesn't count them as individual... Individual, uh shots but like he bursts 40 so it does 40 times 8 and 40 times 12 and rolls between those and sends it i don't know how it counts these fucking things where these like highlighted they look weird oh well yeah i'll try it out where's his other gun Oh, he put it away. Give me two, because uh, what's his face can get a sniper as well. Joe. Queen of snipers for everybody now. I need to use this shit. Actually, how is this? Body range, 12.24. Yeah, so this and this ammo, useless now. <laughs> All of a sudden. <laughs> ah, these, this stuff didn't live long. Barely started using it. I could give Joe the other uh, minigun, but I think it bursts 40. And he only has 600 plus 120. Yeah, like 701 ammo. It's not gonna live long for one person with a minigun. So I'm just not going to. Not going to take care. What I'm going to do is put everybody in sniper mode. Try to snipe these boys out. So we're gonna set up. Bunch up nicely, so if they burst us, we can all catch the bullets. All right. That's not good. Burst can hit with more bullets instead of just sniping. I fucking hate night missions. Man, I kind of want to restart, but at the same time, that would be a stupid idea at this point. Use it. Fucking hell. do we do with these guys then do we just send in the bursts just burst them or well, we could go the other way sneak up stand up and shoot the shit out of the place yeah. they're not going to shoot us right it looks like they're hiding, which is good. We can just run up on them fools. Don't have windows. Right. 
Burst masters. The job is to burst. And not be stupid. Look at that, he can't burst with the minigun while he's prone. Damn. So that perk, what was that perk again? That I was like, hmm, maybe uh, prone stuff is not that good. Range, oh, he can get bonus ranged damage. Oh, and he has one. Oh, that's definitely going for him. Racing, plus to strain for the purpose of firing guns from standing. But he can burst with, with crouch, right? So that would still be better. Dodger educated, explore faster, flexible. I think it was this. It was probably that. Stuntman. What's stuntman? I still don't know what falling is. Toughness. Wait, he can get toughness? What? When did he get enough luck? When did he get an extra luck? What the fuck? Did he just evolve himself into an extra luck? Oh, wait. I gave him gifted because he had something else. And I never realized that. Or maybe I did realize, but it's been... The, his mutation was the previous uh, perk. He can actually go with toughness. Holy shit, he can go with whatever. Oh no, actually his previous was bonus range damage. He's gonna get bonus range damage again. Extra 15%. So his gun is a little stronger now. 914, look at that. He can burst with the crouchy crouch. Makes sense that you can't use them uh, in prone. That would be weird. But he should still crouchy crouch. You're gonna stand up and just annihilate. Um, don't be behind the others. That I will not tolerate if you burst them down with your stupid minigun. Don't be in front of them either. Sure, you will just have to turn around real fast. Hey guys! Fuck! Ha! Huh. Super Mutant dances to the rhythm of lead. Jax critically hit Super Mutant for 400 points of damage, bypassing his defenses. He crit his ass. He's got 6% chance. Um, and he did burst away, uh, yeah, 40. Damn, that's gonna be... I feel like that's gonna be a waste on super mutants. Put his shit back. We don't have enough bullets for this shit. And we have thousands in the car, thousands of basically everybody. 1600 on this asshole. So yeah, we're just gonna burst with these things. What the hell are you doing with 1400? You're a sniper. <laughs> Alright. How do we deal with this asshole? Only we had grenades. Then again, it doesn't really let me throw grenades at the target's location when I see them like that because it's gonna be like, oh, location locked. That's what it always does. So I have to throw it next. Although, I think Molotovs are the only garbage ass grenades, quote unquote grenades. Like, no area of effect. Frags would be better. We could get some frags from the other, other place. So, you know what? Farsight. Being the, uh, being the least armored person just going to run out in the open. She loves danger. She's gonna grab some grenades. Already 52 grenades here. 
Just stab five. Oh, wait, we should unequip the M16s because they have some ammo in them as well. Although, I'm not going to use the minigun in this mission, so, yeah. Alright, give these grenades to... I don't know, it doesn't matter. Just give it to someone who's better armored than you. Joe. She's super cool. Everybody, get the fuck away. Duck. Jackson Brian, we walk their ass over here. And. Ouch! Alright, Joe. It's your time to shine. You stupid fuck. Didn't work. Those trees are pesky. <laughs> I can't run to the other side either because of the fucking fans. There's no way to dismantle these uh, these fences either. There's just nothing we can do. Yeah, there's nothing we can do. We can only go around. I mean, we could go around. There's not much on this side. Some muties in... Uh, in hiding, though. Sniper squad will take care of these assholes. Oh, we actually see them from there. Oh shit, they have something that can't even hit us, haha, <laughs> lol, stupid. Why can't you see that guy? Parsite, what's your accuracy on this? 75%, okay. Well, we have the ammo, so keep at it. Fucking foresight with her augments. I'm guessing that guy also has thingies. Fuck. Oh shit. Stitch! I think Stitch ate all of those bullets. Like, every single one. Entire burst of that man, or actually super mutant. You don't know if it's a man or not. The entire burst was just embedded in Stitch's forehead or something. Not even going to swap him out of the, uh, the thing. You should sneak behind him and just unload. Piece of shit! I'm going to get you. I'm going to go around so you can't shoot us. swap stitch to burst now this is going to be beautiful just just watch it's going to be amazing he will not know what hit him
Keep going. Death is not the end. Unless my main dies, of course. <laughs> he just turns around and bursts us off the ladder. I have flashbacks to the uh, ladder climbing uh, death claws. We're just trying to climb up and we kept shooting them off the ladders. <laughs> ah. Oh, I think we need need these guys. Ah, got a bookshelf in there at least. Haven't seen first aid book in a while. Don't shoot us. So they burst once and then they just stand there like retards. Interesting. <laughs> oh my fucking god. Okay, he's blind now. Fuck him.
why she can't fucking hit him. But she can't. What the fuck? What the fuck? Knocked out, yeah. I, I would call that a knockout. What are we doing with this fucking guy? Maybe this is when we need the grenades. You just run out, run up there, run under the fucking thing, and just keep throwing stuff. You know what? That's what they're going to do. I'm gonna go back for a grenade. Or 12. Brian should also get some heals. But he won't. He doesn't deserve it. He's been a bad aim. Could also maybe stealth climb up to this, but I feel like he would notice that. Right, buddy. Time's up. <coughs> Get fucked. Ooh. Stupid fucking idiots. your drugs consume your drugs increase your perception <laughs> don't worry about the negative it's still a net positive throw to blindly throw where others have not thrown before is it still there Still there. <laughs> what the fuck? This one guy doesn't want to die. This one asshole. doesn't want to die. So Brian is severely wounded still, but that's okay. Where is he? He's fucking gone. There he is. Someone always dies to that. I'm gonna hide behind that car over there. guy's pissing me off. I could just leave his ass here. We don't need him killed. We only need to kill the leaders. 
but he's pissing me off. All right, you pissed him off. Well, that's nice. Girl, you anger me. Why don't you reload, you stupid idiot? Move up. They had to have her stand up so she could get shot. You know, it's the principle of things. We need to we need to flex on his ass. Get up there and get the ammo. Where stitch stitches people up. What the hell? Got some 50 cal. Nice. Oh wait, we're going this way. Except these two. It seems like there's no one in there. is dead. Hopefully it's not booby trapped. Okay, he just ran through the fire. Like it's nothing. Oh, it's actually nothing. Okay. Oh shit. Bad mutante. So there's the blind guy. Fucking tree. Looks like there's no one up here, or I mean, there could be someone actually. We will never know. Don't do that. Oh, shit, he's coming.
Whee! Running free. Oh, we're reaching the edge. Gonna go up here and provide some support. Shooting in the door. Okay, we can actually see the guy. He's dead. A little too heavy. too heavy still mm, nice this garbage away no you stupid fuck move closer Jesus. Oh my god! <laughs> I again barely missed her fucking name. Great, this thing is full. She's still fat. You know what? Drop that shit. Drop two of these. Oh shit. Ooh. Are you fucking kidding me? Why? Why you do this? I know why, but still. That guy is indoors. Our side. Oh, so we need six, six, seven for bonus something. I don't even know what. What was six, six, seven? Oh, bonus rate of fire at level fifteen. Okay. Bonus range to jet damage needs six agility and six luck. She kind of four luck. Oh, what? Fuck you. What about Sniper? 8 Perception, 8 Agility. Alright, so she could have 1 Agility. She already doesn't really need Sharpshooter because she's like 80% from here and he's indoors, like crouching. Motherfucker is accurate. Scott Ranger, quick, quick. Pack Rat, Night Medic. Life Giver wouldn't be bad for her because she's, you know, trash endurance. Gunner Healer. I might give her Life Giver. The Sniper is 20, level 24. Yeah. They'll have a couple more perks. So down the line, she'll get an agility. I think I'm gonna give her Life Giver. Or maybe Dodger. Well, the life giver is probably better. Yeah. And action boy is not that important in here, I think. But you get some extra life per level up. Or... Because by the time we get to level 24, that's gonna be an extra 12. 
12 times 4 HP on top of her endurance, which is not much, but hey. This is going to add up, so she'll be in line with the, uh, s the strong endurance heavy people, which is nice. Sure, she was going to be a sniper, but the way I play this game, even my snipers get fucked. Because, you know, apparently... Oh, that's a commander, actually. Wow. She's not using the gun at 50 range right now, because this guy's shooting back, and that guy only has, like, 40 range, so... You know. Life giver. Oh, she got... Oh, she was juggling multiple perks. Okay, so I guess she could get Dodger. Or, actually, fuck that. She's get... She's gonna get the second perk of Life Giver. So, 8. So, 12 times 8 extra health by the time we get the Sniper. So, yeah, that's that's gonna be good for her. Okay, went down. It just allows me to regen my AP, so that's fine. I should actually check who's juggling multiple perks. I think Jax is. Oh, no, Jax, Jax is out. This guy's out. Brian might be juggling multiple perks. Yeah, because he only has two. And we should have four. 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 Three. So this guy has one. This guy has two. So Brian could get... Uh, what does Brian need? So he's got six, five perception, five int, and nine agility. For bonus rate of fire, we need six, six, seven. Bonus rate of fire is at level 15, so next perk. So 6, 6, 7. So he's gonna get a perception and an intelligence, is what he's going to get. And then at level 15, he can get bonus rate of fire. So he'll only need 2 AP. Because honestly, that's better than getting uh, more action points. You know? Because when he goes to 0, that extra action point he starts the combat with is not going to matter. And it doesn't increase our regen rate. But bonus rate of fire will lower the waiting time between uh, shots that are from 0 AP to 3. Because they will be 0 AP to 2 AP with sniper. And with burst it's going to be 3. Aha! So yeah, he's going to gain a perception. Boink. And uh, intelligence. Boink. So oh, he's ready for bonus rate of fire. Six, six, seven. He's ready for bonus rate of fire. She's not. Six, six, seven. She needs one more perception, one more agility. Yeah, it's just trash. This guy is also trash. Yeah, these these two have been the uh, the fucking question mark people since I got them, really. <laughs> but I'm not gonna swap them out. They will have a chance. What about this idiot? What is this idiot waiting for? Six, six, seven. So bonus rate of fire is going to be okay. Honestly, I'm gonna give life giver to this asshole as well. Or just more crits, maybe. Ah, life giver. Life giver. Because if I walk them into a burst, like a bad situation, they can get one shot by assholes bursting. And since miniguns are appearing, it's gonna get even worse, so... Because what else would be a thing? Better crit... Oh, wait, she can get better criticals. <laughs> Alright. That's there. What's What do we need for better criticals? Better criticals require... 6 perception, 6 luck, and 4 agility. Okay. Can trigger an instant kill effect. Well, or NG, or NG weapons. I swear, one day we'll get a laser rifle or something. All right, so he's ducking, which means I'm gonna send the. Uh, send the bursters in. Jack's going to just stint himself a little bit. 11. Ugh. Gross. So 
avoid the goop if we can. That's the locker room, so don't have to worry about that. Looks like this place doesn't really have windows either. Right. Show him. I show the master. So the master. Commander's dead. 2000 XP. Motherfucking far side. Yeah. So she's gonna get bonus uh, rate of fire next. Two fucking AP per sniper shot. <laughs> oh my god. That's gonna be tasty. Alright, idiots. Run in there. Good. Area clear. Search the room. Actually, where's Joe? Just who knows the, if these assholes booby trap anything? There were a lot of booby traps in the previous map. On shelves and such. Red! Whoa, an FN fell. Is not as good as it might be. I prefer range over damage, honestly. Is that a corpse here? Neostad Combat SG. What the fuck is that? Oh. It's a random shotgun. Two, actually. Wait, isn't that what... Oh no, Stitch has better stuff, I think. The, uh... The car. Yeah. Ca cause. For a great cause. I think it's better than the Neostead. Automatic 12 gauge military shotgun. The best weapon for close quarters, except for flamethrower. Maybe it's... But I think I've seen this before. We saw a couple of these. I don't know. Whatever, we'll compare, just to be safe and sure. A lot of ammo, good, thank you. I also bartered some of the uh, 762s away. I think I bartered like four or five hundred away during uh, trading with the uh, trading four uh, steam packs. Because I have so much. I have more 762s. Ooh, that's what I wanted to see for a while. I have more uh, 762 than all the 9 mil we collected over the course of the game, I think. Because that's like 7,000 or something for 9 mil balls. And we have like 4,000 on us for 762, a couple thousand in the car, and I also sold hundreds, so... <laughs> that's a lot. Let's see that Neo Stud X. Give your stud to Stitch. Both of them you can compare. Loading up the shed ammo. Well, you know, not the shed ammo. Actually. It's not bad, honestly, against mutants it would be probably good, unless they're armored, and even then, probably still good. Alright. It can single fire for 22 range, 1525. 30 range, 1520. Yeah, it's the one that we had before. 
the cars. 13, 22, 17 range, yeah. Oh. What a nice secret weapon ring. These motherfuckers should have AKs. Or actually, is the FN Fal a uh, big gun? Hold on, let me check that. Da -da -da. Dodger needs six agility. Four tactics. FN Fal. Let's see if it's a big gun or not. Small gun. Okay, so, okay. Cool, 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 cool. We can replace the M16s with FN Fals for the snipers, so they also have something that bursts and bursts 762. Someone had an FN Fal, and I also put one in the locker somewhere. Alright, so Joe has one. With the glue. Because we want to use the uh, 556 with the minigun. Yay! 28 range, so it's not as good as the, this fucker 40 range with bursting. God damn. 35. 3146 though. Damage. It's a lot better range of damage. But a lot worse range of distance. But still, when we want to burst with the uh, snipers, is generally when they just go around cover or corner or something, so that's okay. Shit. Honestly, I should just drop this. 40 pounds, 15 pounds. Oh, we're just gonna drop a saw. So. Wait, there were things in here. Shelves. Hold on, everybody. Where's that saw we dropped? Did we hoard everything from these guys? I think we did. We hoarded everything from here. Also, there are shells in here, so I don't know why it... <laughs> I walked them to the furthest fucking thing. Oh, no. They are already here. Might as well try to put stuff on the shelf. The shelf is already full. Oh, there's a, another saw here. Look at that. No. And there's an axe handle. Hmm. A lot of saws. Still immobile. Still immobile. By the time they get there, the chef is also going to be full. Be good. Stitch doesn't need the book of first aid, right? Because Stitch is already above 100. This thing is now negative. And also the environmental suit. But I think the power armor doesn't have that negative anymore. So someone else should get the book on first aid. Just, just for funsies. Or Sight could get it. Or whoever has it right now. Try and just eat it. Just fucking eat that book. Eat that book! So it wanted us to kill the commanders. 
We only killed one so far, so there's probably more. Why are you so heavy? Clear this building first because it's far, far down. Oh shit! There's the entrance. Oh, oh! Looks like it's empty. Aha! We cleared it. Easiest clear. I don't see anybody in there. As we approach, boldly running. What's up? Empty. Maybe the mutants already left because we killed their leader. Look at that, they had a big book of science. Yeah, I don't think that's gonna do much for him. What's your science? 19. Well. It's not better. <laughs> Yay. They have one of these nice scope piles. No. Nothing. What the fuck? Is that a window? Ow. Shit. That might be a window, actually. Whoops. Actually, don't use that. Start eating your drugs. Eat! Get one more. Alright, that's good enough. Ooh, that's a cool tree. So we're on the other side of this. I think we've been in this, yeah. Have we been around? We killed guys in here. We were here. This is where we came from. Oh, we didn't go up on this building. But I think we shot the guy that was there. I think. He probably did, because we came down here. Yeah. Then we went into the locker room 
down here, killed these guys, had some fun with that asshole on the tower. Yeah, I think the last building. Clear these. This might be the last building, yeah. Oh, we were actually shooting at this building from here. This guy at the, uh... Little position there. Had some trouble with him. Are those lootable chests? Whoa. There's probably the second commander. I think there was someone else in here as well. Oh, this is shit. We can't really go in there. Is this guy dead? Okay, good. I don't know if that was a window or just one of those walls. You know, those... Fake walls. Alright, that's not cool. One guy, two guy. Where's the third one? Oh, there it is. Okay. Farsight could probably shoot the guy from here. Honestly. Also, I see a dead guy. I don't know if I looted that or not. Can you not move closer in? There you go. Dude, you guys are shooting me back. You can get him. Complete. You have successfully eliminated all of the super mutant commanders. Return to the ghoul bishop. Not yet, there's a guy. Who needs some healing? Jack's got shot in the back. I think. Gonna shoot first, pussy! Who's dying here? Ha ha, you! <laughs> Objective complete, protect the ghoul bishop. So that was the last guy. Very nice. Uh, stitch. You gotta... Actually, we don't need to heal anyone anymore. That was the last guy. No need to waste that. Everybody nice and nice and healed up as much as they need to be. Let's check this guy and then we can check the chests. Oh, look at that. Got some goods. Check for any boobies. Okay. That is good. That goes to Stitch. Hopefully it's not gonna have worse range then. Oh my god. Damn, but he already has the cause. Look at that. Damn, these chests are basically for Stitch. Got some goods for Stitch. 
means he's probably going to get overloaded. That punk or jackhammer looks ugly though. What the fuck? Alright, dude. The jackhammer, despite its name, it's an easy to control shotgun, even when fuck. Even when fired on fully automatic. Popular bullpup design, which places the magazine behind the trigger, makes the weapon well balanced and easy to control. Five strain needed. He's got that. Yeah, this needed six. So, uh, yeah. It can single. 30. Yeah, 30 range. 20, 32. 30 range worse. Hell yeah. 24 range. 24 range. 17, 28. Yeah, cool. Vancouver and Jacomar. Very nice. He's got some shells for it. I've been saving up these flachettes and the slugs. I think I have like 150 flachettes now. With this extra 60, which is nice. And I have like an extra 100 shells, normal shells in the... Uh, I'm guessing these are buckshots. Uh, in the... What's we call it? The car. So that's nice. He can shotgun away. Okay, let's check the commander and his goons. What did he have? Just the same shit. Alright, Glue is not encumbered, so Glue is going to do the running. Everybody else stays here. If Glue gets shot by something, I'm going to be sad. Actually, first, I want to look at this little shed up in the in booth of fuck nowhere. Because I didn't see any uh, highlighted objects. You know, like shelves or chest or ice chest or fridge. But who knows. It's suspicious. The Ghouls must be hiding some kind of... Super weapon here. Not in them corn fields. Must be. Aha! Oh, that was just. It's a really wounded. Yeah, there are shells, but we can't really touch them. Sucks. Fucking night mission. Oh. oh, yeah, there's a dead guy. Uh, I'm gonna have to strip this map clean after this. Park someone at the edge and just run around. So our brothers are still not bad or not here to replace us. Hello, Acolyte. Woe be to the holy flock who suffers unrighteous wrath in spite of the brotherly shielding offered. And my lord will tremble with terrible fury at the untimely death of his children. In spite of your inability to completely protect us. It is now his will to entrust you with his mortal shell containing his fiery, godly essence. May the ever-contaminating watch over you and guide your fumbling hand. I mean, I didn't have like 15 people to position five on each at each gate. And even if I had, at least a couple ghouls would have died, no matter what, so... I don't know. Maybe someone did this without losing any ghoul. It's probably possible, but at the same time, only Bishop was the important <laughs> ghoul to defend. The rest, I don't give a fuck about. So, we're done with that. We got the... Uh... The Bishop has consented. Yep. Repo squad arrives and collects the nuke. Mission complete. Proceed to the exit grid. 
I'm glad that Smudge and Smear, or whatever they are called, those squads never arrived. You know, they were supposed to relieve us of defense, but they never arrived. <laughs> where is the exit? Where do we... where do we leave? Ah, is it just gonna be wherever? Yeah, it looks like it's gonna be just wherever. Very good. Okay. Now since one is right here. All of these assholes can walk there. We will collect some stuff. Encumbered, still mobile. Uh, I don't even know who has the most weight they can carry. 200, 200. Huh. So Jackson Joe will run around. This asshole can just move here. <laughs> Alright, Joe, give all your shit to Stitch. Even your drugs, because that's another 13. 13 weight, and like most of your stim packs. We'll give our sight here and stuff. The minigun is so much lighter than the fucking saw. What the hell? It's only 28 and the saw is 40 something pounds. Uh, what is this ammo? Wait, it's 303. We've. <laughs> we never even used it. It's so trash. Where's the cursor? There you go. So uh, this is gonna take a while. A feel. Oh. Far side is immobile. That guy is also immobile, but this guy, Brian, can walk here and become the shining beacon. You know, he's a little closer to the exit grid. Alright, let's start with the closest stuff. Let's see if Glue made it. Okay, Glue made it. She can just whatever. Okay, that's empty. I think this was completely empty. Didn't leave anything behind. Books are untouchable. I'm going to take everything, by the way, so... Yeah, and after that we go back to the beach and do bartering, so, yeah, you know. Short mission, this was. Pretty short. Encumbered. Gross. Immobile. Right, so you start moving back. Saws aren't the new AKs. Can't be sold for anything. Oh, there's something there. Explosive rocket. Oh. Ten! Interesting. Was there some kind of guy that blew up there? You can also go back because you're kind of on the edge of encumbrance. Wait, 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 don't go in there. Oh, shit. You know what, Glue? Glue. Get off the green. I just realized. <laughs> we don't want to accidentally step on the green with all the people. Who is this asshole? Is this Brian? Yeah. Severely wounded. Hopefully he's not going to randomly take damage. 
by being overloaded. How heavy is this? Five pounds? Yeah, give it here. Give it. Alright, so... What was in this building? Oh yeah, nothing. I think. Yeah, that's what they started with, and there was nothing in there. This is clear. Let's move to this building. I think there was nothing in this. But I don't remember. Oh yeah, I didn't even touch. I think I took everything from these. Oh no, never mind. Some crowbars. No loot left behind, even if I can only sell it for like two bucks a piece. I will sell it. Took all the stuff from there. Shotgun, shotgun shells and healing supplies. I wonder where the when the uh, robots will appear. Because this is like mission 12, 11? So we are over the halfway point with this, I think. It's pretty cool. Oh yeah, all those grenades. <laughs> oh no. Dropped a bunch of grenades next to Glue's location as well, I think. Super Mutante. There's nothing there. And all the pipes. The metal pipes. I don't know how to get to this roof. This might be a... Oh, actually, there's no way to get on the roof. So I'll never be able to touch this mutant. It, it never even came in here, actually. So let's save, because these guys might be booby-trapped. We've encountered... At least one booby trapped corpse so far. Look at that, more shotguns. Money. Oh. Nice. It was like the Soviet ghouls. One had money, one had healing supplies, and one had guns and ammo. Say, so I don't know how to get this guy. see any uh, ladders or anything it was just up there why he's lonesome oh the lockers the lockers with stuff no someone needs to loot that guy I don't know if I looted all these oh I haven't I think one more stuff and she's gonna be uh, immobile, so... Yeah. 
Dang it. Uh, but yeah, this is just going to be me walking back and forth, getting all the stuff, then driving back to the base. We already talked to the guys, so no more important dialogues, so I'm probably just gonna end the stream here and... I don't know, put on something in the background. Watch a movie while I do this, because this is going to... <laughs> take a while still. Thanks to the buggies, though, selling all the stuff is a lot faster, because I can just load the car up, drive up to the guy, wait for him to get back to his post, take all the stuff from the car, jump out of the car, and then just sell. So that's gonna be fast, but... I know there's a lot of grenades and stuff on the other side of the, uh, the church as well. A bunch of saws and shit that I dropped. So... Should have sent one more person to glue. But at least glue is going to be the drop off point there, so that's okay. But, anyways, that was Kansas. Or Gravestone? Grave. I think Gravestone is a game. Uh, Grave something. Grave Hill. I don't know what this place's name is. Who cares? Kansas City is what it's on the map, so that's what we're going to remember it as. Yes. Unless we have to come back here, of course. Kind of a shorter mission, but... I mean... I guess I could have min-maxed to try and save all the ghouls, but I really don't care. Fuck them. All we needed to save was the bishop, and we did that easy, so... Yeah. And then clearing out these houses was also not that big of a deal. But yeah, hope you enjoyed. I'll... What? Oh yeah, we've been in there. I'll do some scavenging and then some bartering and then that will be it. Hopefully we'll get power armor, maybe, probably not. But I am hoping for an extra environmental armor at least for uh, what's her face because this shit is 35 pounds but the environmental armor or suit or whatever is 25 for the Mark II and 20 for the uh, Mark I so it's 20 weight less or 10 weight less uh, even if we do the Mark II so that would be nice for far side, and also it, it's better armor. Although I think she won't be able to sneak with that, because these lower more stuff than the metal armor. Oh well. So next time we're going to maybe move bunkers, maybe just encounter robots. We'll see. Goodbye. <laughs>